Hello, I'm Bill Cooper with the Center for Liquefied Natural Gas, and we're here in the nation's capital. And let me tell you, it is cold, which brings me to why we're here. Last week, we talked to folks here on the mall to see what they knew about LNG. Let's listen. Mm, light. I have no idea. No idea. <laughs> Something environmental. I have no idea. <laughs> I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I don't know. Liquefied natural gas, something like that. Mm, rockets, rocket fuel. Probably you collect natural gas from some oil refinery and liquefy it instead of burning it and what, cook with it? Liquefied. Um, I believe it's a, an alternative energy source. Something that is processed and, you know, uh, for use in the energy industry. We got liquids. Yeah, liquid, uh, natural gas. Uh, it's a natural gas in liquid form. You can do pretty much do everything with it, I guess. Like energy source. I thought I heard once they did some testing with it for uh, commercial vehicles or something like that. Vehicles, yes. like vehicles run on liquid natural gas. Probably heating of houses and um, government buildings. I'm heating. Honestly, I couldn't tell you. It could be used for the home too, I would guess. It could probably be used just about for anything. LNG is simply natural gas cooled until it becomes a liquid. Putting natural gas into liquid form reduces its size to allow us to import it from other countries around the world. Once LNG is turned back into gas, it's the same as the natural gas millions of Americans use in their homes every day for heating and cooking. We need to import natural gas in the form of LNG because we do not have enough supplies of natural gas here in the U.S. to meet growing demand for clean energy. Liquefied natural gas. Yes. <laughs> um, fossil fuel. It can be uh, brought in from overseas. Another fuel source. It can be shrunk shrunk down from its natural gas size to a liquid form. Let's say liquefied natural gas, uh, commercial vehicles. Shipped. Energy source probably, yeah. And uh, basically uh, used here and shipped back overseas and used. A better way to heat and easier to use. Yeah, it saved the space for the transportation and the storage. Mm -hmm. And maybe it's more efficient. It's a good form of energy, I guess. Going green, which is an extremely noble concept, and I 100% back it. Uh, yes, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I believe so. Absolutely, we could use it. I think it's a good idea. We're in the concept now of going green, which is exactly what that is, and I, I believe that's the proper way to go. And it uh, would reduce some costs around here, too, I would think, if you're, if there's a bigger supply. We need anything new <laughs> in regards to yeah, energy. Yeah, it's among the, the energy choices we need to make. Well... It seems like folks don't know a whole lot about LNG until they talk to us. They found out that LNG is safe, clean, and efficient, and an important source in America's energy future. And now, you know it too. Thanks for the visit. <laughs>